Welcome to the Finger Puppet Management Midterm by Team by the Bay, starring Amber, Sarah, Joey, Albert, Owen, and Ivan. Our shared vision is to create an organized puppet show that is informative, funny, and current. Our project ambitions <clears throat> are to create a show that is well received by its audience. Our team values, we strive to be mature and respectful of each other. If we are unable to come to meetings or if we will be late, we will text each other and keep everyone accountable. Trader Mark Television Show is an American drama set in the lively heart of St. Pete. This series will depict the everyday lives of grocery store managers and employees as they work to provide great customer service, marketing, and promotions. This original series will be a hit and is very competitive, utilizing low-cost, high-efficiency technology to film and produce our show. Our target audience are young adults ages 16 to 30 who are entering the workforce or are moving up in the workforce. The show is to show employee and management relationships and succeed in their future endeavors. Our show follows a young girl named Natalia. Our episode list. Our first episode is the plot and introduction. This is where we introduce all the characters. Natalia, Nick, Megan, and Ashley. Episode 2 will focus on workplace sexual harassment. Episode 3, the focus is on group decision making. Episode 4 is about leadership traits. Episode 5 is about human resource management. Episode 6 is about formulating a strategy. And episode 7 concludes by reinforcing the approaches and effects. Our main characters are Natalia, Nick, Megan, and Ashley. Natalia is an 18-year-old girl and a freshman in college. She is friendly, determined, motivated, and hardworking. She has never had a job before and, to <laughs> and is unsure of what she wants to do, but she wants to make a good impression. Natalia is currently living at home with her parents and drives a 1990 VW Beetle. She feels her parents still treat her as a child, so she doesn't <clears throat> she doesn't want to ask them for any help when making decisions. She is our main character. Our next character is Nick. Nick is a 22-year-old boy and a senior in college. He has worked at Trader Marks for five years and is a valued employee. He sometimes uses his status to slack off but the managers have never said anything about it. He finds the tie very attractive and wants to make something of it. He is up for the assistant manager position at Trader Marks despite his lazy work ethic. Nick is overconfident and sometimes makes Natalia feel uncomfortable. Our next character is Megan. Megan is a 20 year old girl and a sophomore in college. She started working at Trader Marks at a year ago. She is friendly and trustworthy and resembles an average American girl. She is hardworking. She lives alone in an apartment downtown St. Pete and has moved here from New York a year ago to continue her education at USF, where she is attempting to earn her management degree. And last but not least is Ashley. Ashley is our customer service manager at Trader Mart. She has worked for the company for over 10 years, and she is to be promoted to store manager. She is a studious manager who has all the skills necessary to help her and her store succeed. She is very kind and understanding and generally wants to help all her employees and make them feel comfortable at the store. Episode 1. 
Episode one, we introduce all the characters in the workplace. We have Natalia, Ashley, Megan, and Nick. It shows how the characters interact with each other around downtown St. Pete and at the grocery store at Trader Marks. Natalia has been hired as the front desk clerk at Trader Marks. And the customer service manager, Ashley, had introduced her to other employees. After introducing herself, Ashley discussed training and orientation. In episode two, we continue with Natalia's first day. She's very ner nervous, but excited to meet all the employees. Nick tells Natalia she looks good in her outfit. This makes Natalia feel uncomfortable because she does not know him. Natalia is currently training for the first week at Trader Mark. She goes through the training and includes orientation, on the off the job training techniques, technical and personal skills, and conceptual training. In episode three, Ashley has been promoted to store manager and is thinking about the three skills she must acquire. The three skills include technical, interpersonal, and conceptual skills. Also, in episode three, we get to see the employee's interaction. <clears throat> There's an incident at the store. A woman accidentally drops pizza sauce on the floor. Natalia, Megan, and Nick work together to make a group decision about cleaning up the mess and to not waste um, production time and quickly clean up the mess. In episode four, after working at a score for a few months, Ashley feels that Natalia possesses many qualities of a leader. She gives Natalia her performance review and, and comes out with rave reviews. She offers Natalia a raise and she's ecstatic. She tells Natalia she would like to move her up to the cashier position. She talks about the responsibilities that we placed upon her and Natalia assures Ashley that she is confident and will be the best cashier she ever had. Now in episode five, we jump forward a few months. It's November and business is starting to pick up for the holidays. Ashley noticed that she is low on store personnel and decides to hire new people to fill the positions. She interviews dozens of people, putting the emphasis on resume and work ethic. She goes through an intense interviewing process in order to find the best candidates for the job. The company leads the store to success. She looks for every person's unique quality and skills in their past experience. Episode six is during the holidays. Ashley is starting to notice that some things are not running smoothly in the front of the store. She gets together with Nick, the team leader, in order to formulate a plan to improve performance. They work together to come up with a strategy to maximize employee performance and keep the work environment a happy environment. They decide to start training sessions, teaching the new employees customer service Episode 7 is our season's mid-season finale. It's a feel-good story. Ashley and Nick realize the strategy that they implemented with the new employees has worked to a charm. The work atmosphere is positive and uplifting. All employees are happy and well-motivated and love coming to work. Also, with a new great environment, production has been well and Trader Marks is on its way to becoming the best and most profitable business in the Tampa Bay area. They're looking forward to opening a new store in Apollo Beach. The remainder of the course, what we have accomplished. We have accomplished recording three, the first three episodes. We have accomplished our first two milestones. We've also outlined 
the remaining episodes and topics. Um, what is still left to do is writing the scripts for the last four episodes, record the last four episodes, edit, and submit a completed TV show. Sarah is our editor and leader. Amber is the writer and narrator and editor. Joey, Albert, Ivan, and Owen are the puppet performers. Thank you for your time. Goodbye.